A local artist making a name for himself, one pooch at a time. News Channel 9's Latricia Thomas shows us now how he can paint your pet with that extra bit of flair. Latricia. Josh and Kim, Jody Harris didn't dream of painting pet portraits when he was in art school, but he quickly found that sometimes people's pets are the quickest way to their hearts. Pen or pencil, whichever. I grab first. Jody Harris's tools aren't fancy. He's a laid back dog. <laughs> but his subjects that fill the walls of Winder Binder Bookstore on Chattanooga's North Shore are anything but conventional. The chihuahuas, the pugs, and the bulldogs. And the weenie dogs, surprisingly, those are the four that's the most popular that I've been. And less than a block away from the makeshift gallery, Harris sets up shop, a stone's throw away from one of Chattanooga's most recognizable landmarks. Going to school in Atlanta, I had got into uh, a lot of graffiti, been to New York, uh, Chicago. Three years ago, I just got burnt out. And I said I wanted to do something different. A little something different turned into dogs of every shape and size, painted in Harris's signature style. A noticeable first quality or characteristic about that dog. That, and that when they tell me that, that's what I embody and try and bring out. For this bulldog, it's a four-legged friend with flair. She was like, yeah, I want to put some gazelles on it. You know, because he's like a... A superstar anyway. What starts out as a sketch. Yeah, the, basically the underpainting or the filling in, the first filling in. Quickly transforms into a colorful capture of this particular pooch. That's the fun part of it, like just going wherever it, it takes you, basically. And 30 minutes after the first brush stroke, the bulldog is done, ready for the proud pet owner or tail wagging enthusiast to take home. As an artist, that is the most fulfilling part, you know, like even more than monetary gain or whatever, like that they can connect some kind of memory to it by looking at it. And Jody can paint a pet from a picture or his imagination and has even live painted at a children's birthday party before. But he says you can't put a price on capturing the true spirit of his canine subjects. And in case you were wondering, no, he does not do cats. Chickens? Birds? No. Th does he like uh -huh. dogs? He doesn't like dogs. You know, he said really? he lived with a dog with a roommate one time and right. it just wasn't a good experience, so he'd rather paint them than be a roommate with I've, them. I've never seen a dog with glasses before. But it was cute. Yeah, yeah. it looked Super great. Super cute. A yeah. little bit of personality there. And if you know a company that we should feature on our Made in Our Hometown, go to newschannelline.com, scroll down to the Made In section, and submit your idea. We'd love to hear from you.